Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rad here from Rad Kutarot and this is going to be daily tarot reading for June 20th, 2018. So four cards spread as per usual for the day. The first card is going to express <clears throat> the topic of the day. The second card going to express the challenges. It's not even a challenges, but it's it's rather what we should restrain ourselves of doing during that particular day. Then we do have the third card pointing up the positive things we could do or how it's the most positive way to face the topic of the day. And the last card is showing up at the long term prospect or how the day is going to pay off in the long run in case we do keep these couple of conditions checked over here. So <clears throat> the topic of the day of, as the first card that will be the fool. So we do have a card of new beginnings and also the fool is a card of uh, a very general sense of uh, the topic. It's about to give our so-called quote-unquote immature ideas and an expression and to believe that they could happen. So uh, what seemed impossible until this very day, now at that particular day could become possible and I will give you on an example right now let's say that you do have that amazing idea but you could not find any support for it and you have found yourself so far the lonely voice in the desert. Well now at that day it is very likely that someone will start listening. But yeah, as if we go with the keywords here, we do have the new beginning. Very important to be said for the full card is if, if this is a about brand new job of yours, brand new relationship of yours, etc, etc, to, uh, to be more prone to the uh, pros rather than the cons, okay, because the, the full always sees the positivity into the uh, of the picture rather than to be focused on the negativity of the picture so it's very important during that day to remain positive and to believe that the best is yet to come because the fool is also about a, a leap of faith and if we do have a little bit more faith things are going to start working for us. Very important with that card is that it is likely that we're going to have some interactions with people all right and um, it is um, most likely these people will be a brand new people into our lives. Very important there is to be rather, um, uh, what, what was the word here, to be rather carefree and sincere with our interactions, like, uh, like how the child are interacting with one another, you know what I mean, without any surreptitious back intentions. So uh, what we could do to ruin that particular new beginning of ours, that will be the tree of um, <clears throat> that will be the tree of wands. And in that particular case the tree of wands this point that even though we can we can achieve these things today, you know, even though we do have an opening today, uh, we may find ourselves unsatisfied by that particular opening and we would want for more. Important things here are that uh, <clears throat> we should not put any additional demands upon the, the, the deal in case this is about deal strike. Just to give you an example, a very thin line is in between the four and the three of ones guys and I will try to give you the example of that so you can make it up for yourself. All right. So let's say that um, a person wants to start a job and finally he, uh, that person got the job they want it however the contract they have to sign they would rather want it to be a better contract all right and instead of signing the contract and start and starting the job that they wanted they may what do additional demands and that would could, and that could ruin the uh, the new beginning or in other words the job so in case this is about uh, your new relationships you know it, it will be important to accept the relationship the way it is as it starts okay apart uh, instead of trying to start adapting the relationship to your personal um, <clears throat> line of work or line of life in general all right and same goes for your career it's just um, it is very important here to just uh, observe how the situation is and you will find yourself very well adaptable to it rather than to try to adapt the situation to yourself. Very important here is to realize that the challenges are already set and you don't have to set additional challenges in front of yourself. Additional challenges may ruin your new beginning or the expression of the idea that you do have. You just need to go with the current. It is all that you need to do in order to avoid the negativity 
of three of wands and then we do have how best we could uh, face this uh, this new uh, this theme this topic and uh, it is about resisting the uh, the resistance <laughs> all right well let's say that this is going to be a test of faith all right and as I said you need to have a leap of faith it is a faith what you could lack during that particular day because this is all uh, the way I see this card in that particular conjunction it is not the um, outworthy um, opposition it is rather inworthy opposition what I mean is that you may oppose yourself by lacking self-belief say self-confidence um, <clears throat> etc etc very important with the se with the seven of swords is as well to guard your boundaries in the sense of that uh, you should not allow people to infiltrate your personal uh, space and um, you know your personal life in case you don't want those people to infiltrate that particular uh, life so in other words guys you need to place a certain boundaries around yourself so you can totally focus on as I said the new the new idea the new beginning you know new job or new relationships in other words everything needs to be left in the past whatever it is done it's done and we need to continue on moving forward Seven of Wands is one of the cards that points that there will be a third party which will try, you know, to at least, if not ruin here, the uh, the new step for you, for you, at least to diminish the positivity of that particular step. This could be the parent who holds back their children. Uh, this could be, uh, you know, the, uh, the teacher who <clears throat> kind of like... Um, uh, it, it is scribing a, a bad uh, grades to the student just because they hate them etc etc that could be the boss who stops your unfoldment because you know because they, they just don't like to see you um, thriving or they do have that grudge holding uh, for yourself uh, towards you etc etc and what you need to do here is resist the resistance in other words you have to recognize that if, if in case someone is holding you back you know you, you should not put any other demands or kind of try to satisfy that person but just try to you know set a certain boundaries and take the leap of faith and in the long run <clears throat> That thing will, will lead you to a, a very huge personal growth with the Tree of Pentacles. And even if you have to detach from a certain uh, authority figures here, uh, which you thought that they are uh, supporting you through your development, you will find the correct figure, uh, figures which are going to support you a little bit further into the future with that card, Tree of Pentacles. And you will have a very... Um, productive cooperation with these people they will point you to the right direction they will uh, share their knowledge and skill with you all right so uh, the way i see that particular day is that many of us if not the most of us will try something new most of us will um you know try something which is they are highly inexperienced in it and uh, they may receive they have a, a very um, cruel feedback from uh, from other people uh, just so they can make us despondent you know because they don't want to see us going into that particular direction but if we are persistent enough and if we do have that self-confidence self-belief and, and and faith as well and we still push on to that um, direction which we don't have any experience nor knowledge or clue whatever <clears throat> very soon we're gonna find those which are willing to help us to develop ourselves into that particular direction and they will also uh, te teach us something and the cooperation will be flawless so with that being said guys this was the daily tarot reading for june 20th 2018 i hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and in case you're interested in a private reading with me everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video Rod signing out now see you next time bye